on. He cannot post any TikToks that show us where he has gone. He cannot show us any women that he has pulled. Do not let social media deceive you into thinking that you have options that you do not have. He does not have that option. Many of you do not have that option. <laughs> okay, now she, she started this fight. Let's see how this turns out. Please stop playing pretend. Now that the white man has said what he has to say, it's really making it easy for the ladies to come out and try to go hard. So check this madness out. I know a lot of us have been seeing lately on TikTok these alleged passport bros and the well-traveled bachelor. Shorty's a cutie pie. She's a prototype. I will say this though, and I'm not beating up on you, mama. You have a speech impediment, which is cool. You can't pronounce your R's. My my 12 year old daughter had to go to speech therapy for that, but she's a cutie pie, pretty girl. Who swears that he's going to foreign countries and picking up women. There are no foreign countries or women on his page. So I'm not sure why he is um, attempting to pass that off. But nevertheless, there are some men who are believing him and thinking that this option easily exists based on. Just to clarify, she's talking about Brazil Yesh who uh, has a YouTube channel, it's really starting to grow. He's written books and everything, and I do believe he lives in Brazil. I've, I've supported his channel and stuff like that, but that's what she's talking about, Brazil Yesh. What he's saying, however, he's very clearly holding up a pretend or a completely unused passport. So I just wanted to show everybody today what a used passport looks like. Oh, this is not the fight for you. This is the wrong fight. Are you really going to play passport wars with the passport bros? That might not be the best idea. She's going to show us what a used passport looks like. All right, let's see. So that people can stop being deceived by someone who has never used his passport a day in his life into thinking that they have options that they and he both do not have. Okay. So I keep my passport in here. I'm going to pull it out. My passport has been to four other countries, so I am by no means a globe trotter. At least she admits it, four countries, okay. But as you see, it shows some signs of wear and tear. When I take it out, it immediately opens up. The pages are no longer sticky with newness. You can see all. She's got the little passport. She doesn't have the 50 pager. Throughout my passport, um, I spilled some hair oil on it when I was traveling, so it is stained. Okay. There is a stamp. You can see all throughout my passport. Um, I spilled some hair oil on it when I was traveling, so it is stained. There's a stamp. She's got a stamp in there. Now, I love the challenges. Here's El Wapo's passport. As you can see, it's rather thick. That's the 50 pager. Let's see. That's really me. Really your boy. I had to drop some weight, y'all. Look, that's really me. Fat, fat cheeked and everything. Your boy's gotten in shape. That looks pretty full. Do I have any stamps on this page? Oh, I don't even have any stamps on this page. Psych, I do. I have stamps. Maybe you shouldn't be giving advice, shorty. Maybe, I'm just saying, just dog. Stop doing ugly bum bee stuff, man. Like talking smack to passport bros, yo. You could get wiped up. <laughs> okay, she's got a stamp, y'all. Stamp from when I went to Heathrow. 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 There is a visa from when I went to Russia. Russia. There's okay. One from Russia. I know that's that's neat. Uh, it's kind of cute, but dog, you're a grown woman. Go to speech therapy. You can you can fix that. Some from Brazil. So oh, she's anybody been to Brazil. Who has traveled with their passport can open it up and show you. Um, and he stamps and he has been unwilling or unable to open his passport and show us where he has gone. He cannot post any TikToks that show us where he has gone. He cannot show us any women that he has pulled. So I just say this to remind everybody, do not let social media deceive you into thinking that you have options that you do not have. He does not have that option. Many of you do not have that option. That is okay. <laughs> okay, now she, she started this fight. She and she's saying, hey, be careful who you listen to in these social media streets. Let's see how this turns out. Please stop playing pretend on the Internet in your 50s. Pretend all. That's the boy. Yes. <laughs> Wait, those the receipts. Those look like receipts. Wait a damn minute. Hold on one second. Didn't she just tell us not to pay attention to him? Um, and he stamps and he has been unwilling or unable 
to open his passport and show us where he has gone. He cannot post any TikToks that show us where he has gone. He cannot show us any women that he has pulled. So I just say this to remind everybody, do not let social media deceive you into thinking that you have options that you do not have. He does not have that option. Many of you do not have that option. That is okay. Please stop playing pretend on the- Oh, pretend. We gonna stop playing pretend, okay. <laughs> okay, y'all, yes. Stop pretending, bro. What's wrong with you, man? Man, something's wrong with you Negroes, man. I'm telling you, man. Stop capping, yes. Clearly, you have no stamps in your passport. Shorty Doo-Wop right here knows, is all-knowing and all-seeing. She knows what's up. Let's go. Internet in your 50s. Dad, is she, the Shorty's cheesing right there. Mm -mm -mm. Yes, she's living life. Boy, oh boy. So this looked, I like, I love it. Did you see the one where the lady said that uh, passport bros can't even speak the language and yes, did the whole response in Portuguese. I loved how yes, did that. Yo, shout out to you. Yes. Yo, you win this one. That's my guy right there. That's my guy. Good job, bro. Ah, you got a whole bunch. Of they coming in pairs. She said that he can't pull any chicks and he's got an empty passport and she showed us one stamp see i love foreign women what does it say whoops it says the foreign woman foreign women love this tall six foot seven slim blue book gentleman and yes yeah yes uh coined the term yeah yes is yes is the man yo all right so now now we know okay so they, they they're coming for us at all different types of kung fu man Dog, they're they coming after us, man. They're they coming for us. You got to hit back. You know, they hit you with the, the look. You, you like, Shh. right? Something else. Let's see you try the water technique. The sky is high, the cloud is low. But my water technique is hard to beat. We banded together and boycotted y'all, didn't we? You know why? You guys keep showing your passports. Oh, this fool showed up again it up let's see the stamps we just did that dog where's your passport with your stamps i just did it for you come on man you late let me get him off of here show us that you've actually left the country i just I did have, have you seen the intro to my 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 channel have you watched the intro come on man you remember this guy he got stuck somewhere and it was asking for some help which a lot of chicks do in these social media streets they get flued out and all that stuff and get stuck or they go to All-Star Weekend and get stuck, don't have any money to get back. This happens a lot. This happens a lot. Well, he was saying, thank you for the love. Here we go. So it looks like we have a passport bro that has uh, stumbled into more dust. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. Let's see. We have a passport bro that has stumbled into more dust. And I'm not going to go ad hominem and talk about your hair and the profuse amounts of makeup. I'm glad you have your teeth fixed, though. I am glad about that. Glad about that. I wonder what those eyebrows look like without all of the, what do you put on your eyebrows? Mascara? I don't know. I think that's what you put on your eyelashes. Whatever they may do to make them look bushy. Yeah, I'm not going to, listen. Uh, hey, Cultural Invasion Podcast. I didn't say that. You said it. Okay. You said it. Oh, Dwayne, bruh, what is wrong with y'all? Dennis Sperlin says these are beautiful black queens, man. Don't do that, yo. Don't, don't do that. <laughs> Come on, man. I, the, the, the eyebrow, she's got pretty eyes, though. I will give her that. She's got pretty eyes. But, but I'm saying we stumbled into dust and allegedly That's the country. I don't think man, shut up, man. Listen, allegedly, allegedly, that might not be your hair. Allegedly. 